This is literally one of the most awesome things ever invented. Yo, what's up guys? It's Super Electivar here and welcome to another Pokemon Ash Gray Nuzlocke episode. And today I have... Oops. That was a fail. And today I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, cause even though I just recorded this like last week or something, I don't remember anything. Cause I... I, I don't know. Uh... Okay, I guess we'll take out this guy. I don't need to pass that stinking exam to beat you. Uh, you might have to actually. Okay, so update on last video, we got a great team going on right here, we did some great training, we caught some new Pokemon, and it was just great, so check out the last episode if you have not already, and um, of course, you know, got that Dratini up, actually I think we got Dratini last episode actually, I don't remember, but basically, oh, there's the Gamer JD. alright, shoutouts to you, of course his channel is featured in the description of, oh, I'll keep this guy in. His channel is featured in the description of almost all of my videos. Actually, no, he isn't, actually. No, sorry, he's not even... Uh, he's... Oh, well, what the heck? There's a resort at Cinnabar. I, th I think I vaguely remember that from the anime, but... Basically, this guy, he is featured on my channel, and check out his videos. He is very underrated, just because, you know, how YouTube works is it's huge on sharing, and not necessarily huge on content. That's why viral videos are so viral. <laughs> So, oh, why did I stay in? It's okay. I should be okay. Level, I'm like 12 levels higher. But, yeah. So, yeah, just def definitely check out his stuff. Some of his stuff is actually pretty good. He does a lot of Let's Plays, too. So, if you're here watching my Let's Plays, he's got some great Let's Plays, too. Uh, they're just awesome. So, yeah. This route was so long, I've been walking forever. I agree. Just because it's, it's not that I'd consider it long. It's more like there's just nothing there. It's just so, like... Oh, jeez. It's just so, like, empty. Like, if you look around here, let me show you guys. Yeah, I need a break. Oops. There's just, like, nothing here. Like, it's just, like... What's here? I mean, I'm speeding up. If I'm walking, it takes, like, forever just to, like, get through. Like, seriously. And NPCs can't run because they don't have random people giving them uh, running shoes, so of course it would take so long. Five-star breeding center. Using Pokemon love power to raise your Pokemon. All right. So this is basically the daycare center. Um, wow, th I didn't know there was a doctor. Huh. That, that, that's interesting. Welcome to our breeding center. We can look after one of your Pokemon for you for a while if you like. We guarantee your Pokemon will soon be like new and may even evolve. Would you like to leave a Pokemon with us? Hmm. Why do I have a feeling that I don't want to trust this? Um, I have a feeling that's Jesse and James. Uh, I don't remember the anime doing anything like this. Actually, I do. No, that, that must be Butch and Cassidy, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and stick my Charizard in here, and I'm gonna have a- I'm gonna leave my Aerodactyl in there. Alright, so let's just leave Aerodactyl, because I probably won't be using it. Thank you, we'll take very good care. You won't even miss it. <laughs> yeah, this is so suspicious, man. We're happy to raise Pokemon for unsuspecting trainers. Yeah, this is definitely- yeah, this is definitely- Oh, man. We're still, uh, <laughs> training it. <laughs> just give us a little more time. Yeah, man. Yeah, I won't be seeing that guy in a while. So let's see if I exit and come back. Hey, they're, they're gone. This computer has a message on the screen. Secret holding area has been closed. Would you like to open it? Click yes. Yes. Secret passage opened. Oh, wow. That's awesome. That's awesome. Rocket hideout. Oops, I didn't even see that. Oh man, I love this music actually. It's pretty awesome. I don't even know what I just got. Uh, I think I just got Taunt. I think that's what I just got. Yeah. Alright. There is like nothing here. <laughs> oh, there they are. Yeah, breaking into this breeding center was genius. It's a bagless dream. Oh, oh, I just remembered. This is the breeding center where I left the weeping bell I caught the other day. Oh, look, it evolved into a victory bell. What are you doing here? Don't tell me you're trying to steal these Pokemon for yourself. You'll have to get through us first. All right, guys. We've got victory bell here. And... 
Um, I guess I'll just... I should have brought Charizard back, but that's okay. I'll just... I'll just deal with this guy myself. Shouldn't be too hard, because we've got Miss You, and it's... Miss You is, like, honestly so good. Just because it it, it it makes all these Team Rocket battles so much easier, because I don't really have any other Psychics. So, yeah, just just his existence is just, like, so good, because because I can, um... I can just use Psychic-type moves. And I'm actually going to switch just to give this guy a little bit more experience. And uh, let's go into this guy. I'm going to try not to speed up the Rocket Battles as much as I normally do. Well, I just noticed the Dratini is like purple. That's weird. Oh, come on. I shouldn't have switched. That was a bad idea. Alright. Oh, man. But yeah, okay. I'm losing some PP, so I'm going to conserve some PP. Alright, but yeah, I just noticed uh, this guy's like purple. Because like, he's blue, but like his actual sprite's like purple. I'm trying to remember what shiny Dratini looks like. Because I know mine's not shiny. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm too dangerous. So I'm not going to switch into that guy. Alright. Alright, let's just go with Hydro Pump. Should do a ton of... Okay. That's not too bad. Let's see how much Thunderbolt does. Alright. Okay. Yeah. Fun! Take the Pokemon for yourselves. We're blasting off again. Alright, but... Uh, Dratini. I'm trying to remember what his shiny looks like. Let me check. Well, what do you know? Shiny Dratini. Alright. Uh, there's JD again. <laughs> Alright. Oh, what the? Ugh, I knew there was something right in here. Looks like a rat has snuck in. You don't know what you're dealing with, but we'll be glad to show you. Prepare for trouble and make it double. To infect the world with devastation. To blight all peoples in every nation. To denounce the... Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, to announce... Uh, I can't even speak today. Okay. To denounce the values of Team Rocket. To extend our route to the stars above. Cassidy, Butch, stealing Team Rocket's slogan at the speed of light. Surrender to us now or you'll surely lose the fight. We got this mission from Team Rocket's boss because he couldn't trust Jesse and James. And I also can't do voice acting, which is why I'm not doing it anymore. Let's go. So two double rocket battles, and these guys just have the best sprites, totally custom, totally awesome. And, oh, it's actually a double battle. Level 42. What the heck? Nope. Okay. Let's go ahead and go for Gyarados, because I can lower their attack. And then Pikachu is gonna go... Uh, he's a little low HP, I'm not, I'm not gonna take the risk. Let's go into this guy, because he could... Uh, my Venusaur could... It's so awesome. I love Venusaur so much. So underrated, and I love Mega Venusaur. It's probably... Actually, I love all the Mega uh, Kanto starters. They're all pretty awesome. Yeah, I I'm a huge fan of all that stuff. But Venusaur is awesome, too. It's, it's actually been pretty... I've been a fan of it for a long time. And it's, it's just awesome. It's a dinosaur. Come on, who doesn't like dinosaurs? Alright, who doesn't like... Okay, so we've got leftovers, and I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh, let's see... I'll just Hydro Pump this guy. Alright. That is a decent amount, I guess. Wow. That Giga Drain, though. Let's go for the double secret power. Wow, that doesn't even take him out. Alright, fine. Fine, then. Triple secret power. Level 26. And all experience. Go uh, experience. Experience going around. Love power? What is that? Fine, take your Pokemon back. Yay! So we're gonna go ahead and put Arrow back into the PC, and it'll be awesome. And Charizard can come back. I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna keep lowering his level so much, like, cause like all my other Pokemon are gonna be so high level, and he's gonna just gonna be sitting there. It's gonna be pretty weird. Just, and uh, I'm gonna have to grind him later. <laughs> Hello there, I'm a world class chef. My price is probably too high for you, but if you could show me one of my favorite Pokemon, I'll give you a berry. Today, I'd like to see a Spearow. Uh, yeah. Yep. So I guess we'll go ahead and head down here today. Oh man, Fairy to Cinnabar Island. Ooh, Cinnabar Island. Wait, how many gym badges do we even have? Oh, I already have six. Huh. <laughs> Alright then. Uh, but the last time we met. Oh, gosh. The last time we went onto one of near one of these things, a wild tentacle came and killed Pikachu. Spoiler alert if you haven't seen that, but you guys definitely should check it out. Hey, look! What's a loser like you doing trying to get on this boat? Huh? You want to go to Cinnabar Island to get a badge? Gosh, you're clueless as usual. Only tourists go to Cinnabar Island. It's a resort. I heard so many badges already that I'm taking a break to work on my tan. Ah, uh, hangouts. Jeez, so much social media going on. 
If you're heading to Cinnabar to get a badge, you'll see that you're wasting your time. Cinnabar Island doesn't even have a gym. See ya, Ashy. Oh, my friends are getting online. That's great. <laughs> right when I start recording, all my friends decide to just start coming online. See what you guys are doing? You're taking away my time, my friends. Ahoy, this ship sails. Set sail to the famous resort of Cinnabar Island. We're ready to set sail. Would you like to ride to Cinnabar Island now? Alright. All aboard. Hey, dude, that's my tagline. Don't steal it. Uh, okay, so, okay, so, oh, okay. Isn't there usually, like, a boat cruiser theme or something? I know there's one in Emerald, I think, for Mr. Briny stuff. I don't know why I'm checking these items. There's obviously no items in here. Uh, it's just, like, automatic reflex. All right. Cinnabar Island, the fiery, ta fiery town of burning desire. Tourists come from all over the world to visit Cinnabar Island. All right, man. Hey man, have you tried the hot spring? It's so relaxing. Wait, what hot spring? The gym shut down, alright. Wait, I don't remember there being a hot spring here. I thought that was only Lav Lav uh, Laverage Town. Laverage, I think it. I think it's Laverage Town. This Pokemon Center is so packed, there is nowhere else to stay on this island. It's even no one was at the front desk in the hotel. Wait, nobody was in the front desk of the hotel? Okay, so there's a hotel up north, apparently. Chancy! And this is the Pokemon Lab. I'll bet something's gonna happen here. Oh, there's Hitmonchan and Hitmonlee. All right. Hitmonchan, Hitmonlee, Mid-Key. Oh, Mianki. All right, fine. <laughs> it's all complicated numbers and words that make no sense. Hey, I'm an important doctor. Yes, very much so indeed. I do not have a doctorate degree, and I'm just, you know, doing whatever because it's not illegal or anything. You have a fossil for me? No, oh, it's too bad. Uh, yeah, I don't think I have a fossil. Oh, that's awesome. They put a storage system right there next to this guy. So, that, that I was gonna say that was really good game design, and then I walked into this bookshelf. <laughs> oh, man. And this one, too. And I'm trapped. Okay, this Hitmonlee tried to trap me. So nice. Alright, then. Hi, I'm looking for Charizard. My Gyarados is really hard to train. If you have a Charizard, please trade it to me. Uh, I'm not going to. Just because I have both Gyarados and Charizard. So I don't know if that's an event or something. I guess you can leave a comment in the comment section below. Oh, head scientists research is all sorts of Pokemon discoveries. All right, so there's literally nothing in there. Did I miss something? Or there's there literally nothing. There's literally nothing in here except for the fossil dude. Okay, so, so the point of that is just the fossil dude. All right, all right, Dan. Oh man, all right. What a beautiful island. Oh, there's that hippie Blaine dude. I'm not gonna talk to him for now. Let's go in here and talk to. Don't they have any suntan oil for sale? Too bad they don't have miracle potions for humans. Oh man, <laughs> so true. Jim, Cinnabar Island Pokemon Jim leader Blaine, the hot-headed quizmaster. Doors locked. Oh no. Big riddle in. Oh, I think I kind of remember this. It's Voldemort's place, right? Just kidding. <laughs> There's literally nothing in here. Okay then. I'm sure we'll come back later. Just like everything here. Oh, Cinnabar Hot Spring. Free. It's free, guys. C that's free. Mount Cinnabar, the oldest active volcano in the entire Kanto region. Ah, oh, the sea, an old man like me can't hope to set sail like he used to. Oh man, that's horrible. Alright. Oh cool, it heals you. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> who needs a Pokemon Center, right? Oh man, yeah, who needs a Pokemon Center? So let's go in and talk to Blaine now, and uh... So you're wondering why Cinnabar Island became so popular with the tourists? The answer is a riddle. What do tourists, tourists think is hot and cool? The answer, hot springs. Because of the hot spring from the volcano, tourists have taken over Cinnabar as a vacation getaway. Traders don't come anymore. Tourists, they've ruined the island. Pokemon Gym is right where you put your glasses in front of your eyes. This guy though. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Oops, I accidentally opened up Cortana. No. Sorry, guys. <laughs> I, love, I actually love how they moved the screen to show the Pokemon Gym. That's pretty cool. That's a pretty nice effect. 
We ain't got tired about the trainers who cared more about postcards and t-shirts than about Pokemon. That's why he been in the gym. If you're looking for a badge, you've come to the wrong place. If you need a place to stay, try out my big needle in. Wow, so Blaine just like decided, hey, I'm gonna take over I'm gonna take advantage of all these tourists and open my own inn, you know. Hey man. <laughs> Welcome to Big Riddle Inn. Oh, I'm sorry, but I can't give you a room now. Well, I just learned that the Pokemon map is under attack by thieves. Well no. <laughs> I love how like I could just like walk in there and then I don't I don't even know if eh, I'm not sure if they were here before. Tell you again, listen twerp, we're taking the Pokemon from the lab. This time you won't stop us. Okay, alright, 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 fine. Ah, sweet scent. Cause that's just that's just so ironic, you know? It's like so sweet scent. Cause like Victor Bell's totally a sweet scent. You know? It's like totally a sweet scent. Oh wow, this is level 42, dang. Actually, I, I seem to recall them being high level before as well. Alright, but now I'm poisoned and that really just sucks. Now I'm 42. That's awesome. Alright, and alright. Oh jeez. Oh no. Oh no. Blah 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 blah. Oh why no, I don't wanna Oh I'm dang it. Uh I'm gonna switch. Pikachu! Oh man, one day he's gonna wrap me and he's gonna get static. Alright. Pika Pika grew to level 44. It can't be! It can't be! Ah, beat again! Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again! I like Meowth never does anything. That's great. Yeah, let's heal. Uh, all right, so we saved the Pokemon Lab, and I doubt there's gonna be anything in here for us. Yeah, I don't think so. Yep. So I guess we'll go talk to Blaine now, and uh, oops, not the Pokemon. Pokemart, sorry, not Pokemon. All right, gosh, I heard how you helped save the Pokemon Lab. You deserve a big reward, so I'll let you in on a little secret. Lane built a gym that tourists never see. It's in the place where firefighters could never win. Uh, hot springs maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Let's go. Oh, I see. I see. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. <laughs> the rock is loose. Oh yeah. The rocks fell away to reveal an opening in the wall. Ah, oh, so awesome. This is literally one of the most awesome things ever invented. Like, this was an awesome thing. And how did he even get there before us? Like, seriously, though. But yeah, this, this is a great. This looks awesome. That lava, though. Well, I guess you saw my riddle. Here's another one for you. It's not a hat, but it keeps your head dry. Uh, hair? If you wear it, it's because you already lost it. Uh, glasses? The answer, a wig. Oh, okay. Oh, that's pretty good. Don't you get it? I wear a wig because I'm really playing the gym master. Oh my gosh, I didn't know that. So you want to challenge me? We will have a three-on-three -three match. That means you can only have three Pokemon with you for this battle. You'll have to store some... Blaine just became a PC. <laughs> Blaine just became a legit PC. Okay, so we'll store Charizard because Charizard sucks. <laughs> we will store Venusaur. No. We will store Butterfree because Butterfree can't do anything. It's a bug. And I am really, really, I, I, <laughs> to tell you the truth, I might just bring Dratini in for experience. So let's go in and be an idiot and do that. So, ready to begin. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, bum, ba, da, 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 chum, ba, dun, bum. Leader Blaine would like to battle. Got that nine tails. Level 42. Oh man, I'm, I'm getting really low. Okay, well, this, uh, I mean, <laughs> my levels are getting really low. I'm gonna need to start doing some real training. I think too much Dratini action, that's why. But let's go ahead and send in our Gyarados to destroy this Ninetales in Ninetales. Actually, oh yeah, Ninetales doesn't get dropped. Dang it, okay. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to Venusaur just because I don't want that confusion. Oh gosh, okay. That was not smart. Not smart at all. Okay, that was smart. Okay, so now, oh, come on, man. Okay, okay, I should be able to take this. Oh, dang it, no! Okay, I wonder if I give him a Lumberry. Do I even have a Lumberry? Oh, berry pouch right there. Nope. No, I do not. Okay. Well, I better not die. Thank you. Gyarados pulling through. Right on. All right, let's go into this guy. Ah, because we got that Giga Drain. Awesome. I love how this guy has a ride on though, because it's not even a fire type. Sorry for the speeding up, guys. I just get really impatient. 
Oh my gosh, that did a lot actually. But this Rhydon's- uh, sorry, this guy- this Rhydon only is level 40, so that's interesting. His Ninetales actually higher than his Rhydon. So that's- that's pretty cool actually. Just cause, you know, it shows how, like, you know, it's- it's better to have the red- Oh shoot, I might take poison damage this turn. Dang it. Okay. Let's go- Oh, come on! Okay, we both missed. Okay. Oh my gosh, this guy though. Alright, let's go and heal just cause- Oh, we have full restore. Let's just go with full restore, just cause I don't wanna have to heal the poison afterwards. Cause apparently full restores are worth <laughs> are worth less than uh, antidotes. All right, I'm just gonna thunderbolt this guy because power of electabuzz <laughs> it does nothing. Oh my gosh, are you serious? All right, whatever. After this, we get to heal this guy anyway, so that's why. All right, we got that dig action. All right, you have earned the volcano badge. <laughs> Gyarados, come back, Gyarados. Uh, the Volcano Badge heightens the special stats of your Pokemon. And you can have this too. Uh, 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 fire Blast is the ultimate fire technique. Don't waste it on water, Pokemon. Okay, okay, I'm dying. It's too hot in here. Okay, well, I really shouldn't have wasted that uh, full restore because he ended up dying anyways. Uh, let's go back in here. <laughs> oh man. Alright, so we got Gyarados back. From the dead, back from the dead, and all my Pokemon are just coming here. Uh, I'm just gonna withdraw them. Actually, it's faster that way. Oh man, Blaine's accent is so weird. I don't even know why I use that voice. It's so just so weird. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of. No, I don't want to go back in the Pokemon Center. Okay, uh, is there anything to do here? I don't think so. <laughs> so this gym is always going to be locked. I don't even remember them having a gym in the anime, to be honest. Okay, I think that's it. Uh, yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, let's go! Uh, oops. Nope. Uh, where do I go now? I guess Viridian, right? It's interesting that they didn't tell you to go to Viridian. Actually, I don't even think I fly, though. That sucks. Do I have to walk all the way back? Oh, come on. Don't tell me I have to walk all the way back. Yeah, where do I even get Surf and stuff? Rock Tunnel. I don't know why Rock Tunnel's there. Uh, so I am in the middle of nowhere right now. So that's just great. I'm gonna go back, actually, and just see whether there's anything there. Uh... Oh. Take this old raft I used to sail on, and ex- Uh... Oh, okay. oh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. I see, so I see. Oh no, it's a wild war turtle. It looks agitated and worried. Something bad must have happened. Oh no, what the? Oh man, I could sail everywhere now. Yes. Oh man. Oh man. War Tortle seemed distressed. It's a giant shell. Must contain Blast Toys. All right. So maybe this is where we get Blast Toys. Oh yeah, maybe this is where we get it. Okay. Ooh. Okay. What the? Oh, the sand. Okay. So we get a tentacle. That's just great. That's just great. All right. Uh, let's see if I'm gonna use the rest of my Pokeballs. Yeah. All right. Cools. So great. Alright, so I guess that'll be my encounter for this time. Which is quite unfortunate, because I wanted to catch something, like, actually decent. Oh, like, level 20 tentacle. That's great. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh gosh. Maybe I don't want Dratini at the front. Wow, that's so weird, because the raft actually... Wow, okay, so look, the raft actually goes onto the beach before you get off. Oh, come on. Level 20. Uh, so I couldn't catch a level 20 one. Oh no. Oh, okay. Oh, Dratini though. Shed skin. Okay, but look, I jump on the water before I get on the raft. <laughs> so great. It's down here. What the? Oh. Oh man, I'm gonna need to come back literally everywhere. Hey man. I'm swimming to Cerulean City. Okay, that's gonna take quite a long time, and I'm not even sure if that's possible. To be honest. Nah, Twister. 
Alright, so let's go ahead and bolt this guy. Oh, nice, Rotini. Oh, this tentacle, Revenge of the Pikachu. Got that tentacle out of the way. Finally, Revenge of the Pikachu. Uh, let's battle this little guy there. Oh, or we'll battle this tentacle first. Alright. Hey, man. Don't touch my floaty. Hey, I got my floaty, too. I love how we get to surf on a raft, because <laughs> you could totally surf on a raft. What are we using? Our feet? Or, I mean, our uh, arms and stuff to, to paddle? <laughs> I can just imagine that. It's so weird. Yeah, I can totally imagine that. <laughs> we would be going so much slower, though. Alright, Poliwhirl. Let's go and destroy this Poliwhirl. Wow, when I speed it up, it goes. the water moves so fast. Oh man, there's a fisherman there. Alright. Hey, there's a fisherman there, too. Hey, man. Can you see a fishing kid? Uh, I guess so. Nope. I'm just gonna use Pikachu because Thunderbolt has more PP. Uh, I'll just use Dig, because why not, right? Goldeen. Let's go Brick Break, because we just broke it like a brick. I I'm curious why he leads with Sea King instead of Goldeen, but hey, whatever. Oh wow, this guy's got three Sea King and one Goldeen. That's just weird. <laughs> it's kind of weird. Hey, we got that static. Oh wow, Secret Power's Mud Shot. That's pretty cool. Because we're on the sand. That's awesome. And level 45. Ooh. Okay, I'm gonna surf Ryan. Hey, dude. Just gonna ignore me. We wanna see some magic? Uh, no. Oh, magic. I get it. But these magic cards are actually gonna have moves. So let's go see whether Char. Yeah, see, he's got tackle. Let's see whether Char. Char let's see whether Char uh, Charizard can actually take out a team of six magic cards. Oh, man, this is awesome, though. Got that magic. It's got that magic carp. That's great. <laughs> oh man. Uh, yeah, Charizard's easily gonna be able to take out all these magic carps. But let's see how much damage he actually takes in the process. <laughs> that was great. And I hope you guys don't mind me speeding through this awesome, insane, intense battle. Takes real skill to whip with nothing more than magic carp. I agree. And I'm not even sure if that's possible. Oh, who are you? Oh, I took a dip in the river and I'm out in the ocean. Actually, we're gonna go to Pallet Town now, right? Not to Pallet Town, now that I think of it. Uh, let's go ahead and go into Venusaur and not use a grass move. Let's go ahead and use a dig. Because dig is super effective, whereas grass is not, because that's Pokemon logic. Uh, Psyduck, uh, I haven't used Misty in a while, because I got I have Giga Drain on this guy too, right? So yeah, that's cool. You dead. Now, I wanna about I wanna have a rematch with Misty sometime, because Misty. Oh my gosh, that didn't even kill. But Misty, uh, I believe Ash does... No, I don't think Ash battles Misty too much. Oh, Rock Tunnel. Huh. That's interesting. Um, I guess I'll leave that it. I think that's it for this episode. Um, we will take on Rock Tunnel next time. And I do want to explore the rest of the region. And I might do some research to see where you get all the other HMs. Because I do want to come back and get them. And after I get all the HMs, I'll come back and explore the whole entire region again. But this time, I'll edit a lot of stuff out. And then just show you guys all the stuff that I missed so far. So, thank you guys so much for watching. And uh, be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And if you guys enjoyed this episode, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Yeah, I already said that. Don't forget to share with your friends if you enjoyed as well. And see you guys next time.